what do you feel about the, the, the taking down of the statues uh, of Columbus and all that that's going on right now? Well, I think it's a disgrace. I think mm -hmm. they should be ashamed of themselves. I think it's a, a national disgrace. Mm -hmm. And if they're going to take them down, I did offer that they replace the statues with a statue of me, mm. which I think would be beautiful. I think that would bring everybody together. I think that would look fantastic, to be honest with you. Okay, so maybe we can erect that. Absolutely. It would be the only thing that you're going to be erecting in the next 10 years. Yes, I was very busy. Well, we've got the Chinese flu, and we've got the police reforms I got to deal about, the protests. Mm -hmm. And so I had to deal, I had to pick one. So I did, uh, we planned my birthday party. Mr. President, you were having Wi-Fi issues. Are you back in the bunker? Actually, good, that's not true, okay? Total lie. Are you that's, inspecting the bunker again and you have bad Wi-Fi? Excuse me, that's the fake news, okay? I he is having bad Wi-Fi. <laughs> fake news, and now you literally said it's fake news that you had bad Wi-Fi, and then you started buffering. I think that's real news. That's actual news, Mr. President. Well, excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse, excuse me, me, Mr. President. I just have one you question. Don't know this, but the the fake news doesn't report it, but I've been in the one room today for 10 hours where I make my biggest decisions. The bathroom, okay? <laughs> That's your, yeah, your tweet throne. I, I, I appreciate that. I've been busy all day today. I was inside the war room today, which is any room that I'm in with Melania, because we're arguing. <laughs> well, you know that I'm a stable genius. You know that. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm one of the most intelligent people in the world. Mm -hmm. I don't like to talk about it, but I don't like to share it or brag, but everybody knows that. So I'm a Gemini. I don't know if you know that. I'm a Gemini. And what, is your, what does your horoscope tell you? Well, Je I don't know if you know this, but some of the most famous people in the world were Geminis. I don't know if you know that. Did you know that? Like yes. who? The son of Sam, Jeffrey Dahmer, David Berkowitz. Ted Kaczynski, these are some of the most influential people you'll ever be. No one's I think you mean in, infamous, infamous, infamous. Well, they're, they're, they're unbelievable. They're I don't think people. they're famous. I think well, they're, they're absolutely infamous. Famous. Look, Jeff, no one ever ate somebody. They're infamous. Excuse me. Excuse me. Yeah. You're I don't, rude. You're rude. I'm sorry. No one ever ate somebody after killing them until Jeffrey Dahmer came along. He's he a was pioneer. a pioneer. He was a right, pioneer. No you know that I have a big rally coming up. Where is that yeah. rally again? I heard you chose a very well, uh, disrespectful place. Well, it's in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and there, I thought we sent out invitees. I thought we were going to have like maybe a thousand people. We've got 80 million people showing up, 80 million, which is, they told me, I couldn't believe it. I know you're looking at me. They called me earlier. They said 80 million. And I said, 80 million. I said, that's bigger than the birth of Jesus Christ. And I said, I couldn't believe it. And quite frankly, you know, I'm a little bit more popular than Jesus. I think you know that. I think yeah. Jesus knows that. Yeah, not everybody wore red Jesus hats. Well, not only that, but he had 12 followers, and I have 12 million on Twitter. 